Hey friends, if you like shopping and home decor like I do or simply browsing through the aisles, please like and subscribe. So today I'm doing something different. I'm going to be showing you guys how I decorated my entryway using the dollar finds. Now to start, I like to clear everything so I have a clean slate to work off of. Here I am draping the garland right up top. I'm making it symmetrical, but you can do it off center. The next step is to add the ornaments. The gold ornaments is going to give me a little bit of shine. After working on the garland, I noticed a huge mess below, so I cleaned that up, made some selections on my tabletop decor. I ultimately settled on having the three light up hurricanes in the center and having the other items on the sides. I strung the garland with some fairy lights and I'm going to be utilizing the bottom shelf to display all of the goodies I found at the Target dollar spot as well as introducing the tartan print. If you've been keeping up with my channel, you'll know that this is the pattern that I'm selecting for this year's theme. So to give my picture frame a little bit more height, I'm going to use this wiring here to secure to the back and hang it on this command hook. I tested it out earlier and I thought it was fine, but as I walked away, I realized that it's too low and you can see it from a distance. It's not cute. So let me demonstrate. So when I hang the picture frame on this command hook, it's too low, it wasn't stylish, and it kind of looked tacky. So I ended up ultimately having to rip it off this part scared me really bad. <laughs> I was scared I was gonna break the cabinet, but it ended up working out. Shout out to Command Hooks because this was amazing. It came off so easily and it didn't leave any residue. So if you guys are planning to do something like this, definitely buy Command Hooks, don't make any holes. So as you can see, I've hung the hook a little bit higher so the guests won't see. This will give me a cleaner and more polished look. And I'm going to add some gold to the bottom shelf to mirror the top garland. Finally, I get to have some fun with my Target finds. Target did such a great job with their dollar spot items that I didn't have to think about it. I just ended up putting on a shelf and it matched and coordinated so well. I ended up putting the sleigh at the bottom because it was too large to fit anywhere else. Look at how adorable this deer sign is. He's definitely going to be going on top. And then the skis, I'm going to be putting him on the bottom shelf. And let's see if I can get this to work. Nope, oh, too big. So I ended up swapping the birch for the second shelf and putting the lift on top. Now that's a cute arrangement. So I'm really digging the way it looks. I got the knickknacks right here, some tartan print in the center, and I got my birch logs on the side. We raised the sign with that command hook so it looks great. I can't wait to show you the reveal. And here it is. I love how it turned out. It has that traditional feel while maintaining a current look. Please excuse that last scene. I did cut off the tags, but in that clip, I guess it's still in there. What I love most about decorating my entryway this year was that I was able to get the look while shopping at the discount stores like Marshalls, Walmart, Target Dollar Spot, the 99 cent store, the Dollar Tree. It just goes to show you it's what you select, it's not where you shop. Hit that like button if you agree. If you're new here and like what you see, don't forget to hit that subscribe button. You don't want to miss out my next video where I show you how I decorated my living room. For all my returning watchers, thank you so much for your support. I really do appreciate you all. I'll see you guys all next time. Bye!